Hi, in this video, we'll do a walkthrough of how to use Compose your tools with your AI agents in TypeScript. Let's build a simple Gmail agent that has access to your Gmail and can send an email on your behalf. To begin with, let's install the Compose your TypeScript SDK. Let's initialize the Compose your SDK. I've already copied the Compose your API key to the .env file from the Compose your platform. You can do the same by going to project settings on the Compose your platform. So let's pass that to the Compose your SDK here. Now let's install initialize OpenAI. So we are going to use OpenAI for this demo, but you can also use Anthropic or Google AI. Composio supports all of them. The next step is creating an auth config for this toolkit. So auth config is a blueprint that defines how authentication works for a toolkit across all your users. So you can create a single auth config for all of them from your platform. So except in the cases where you need to define different auth methods or scopes, just create a single auth config from the platform. So let's see how to do that. Go to your project, navigate to auth configs, click on create auth config. We'll choose Gmail. Here you can define the authentication method like OAuth or bearer token. You can also manage scopes. You can add scopes or remove them as and when you need it. Also, you can use, either use your own developer credentials or use the Composio managed authentication. I think for this purpose, like I'll use the Composio managed authentication. So let's create the auth config. Awesome. So we're going to copy the auth config ID that we'll use next to connect your users. Now let's define the auth config ID here. So I've already copied the auth config ID from platform. I'm going to paste it here. So you also need to define a user ID. So a user ID is a very important concept in Composio. It basically determines what account you're accessing and subsequently like what data you're accessing. So everything like tool execution, trigger handling, all is handled through user ID. So you can use a single user ID to represent your user across all toolkits. It's recommended you use a unique user ID, like a database UID or something very unique. Let's use nano ID in our case. Let's install it. For creating a connected account, we'll use Composio Hosted Authentication. So Composio Hosted Authentication handles the entire authentication process, like the OAuth flow or collecting any API key from the user out of the box. So let's see how we'll initialize that. You can also configure a callback URL. Let's just put Composio as our callback URL for now. So this will basically give you a redirect URL that you can send your users to. Okay, so this gives you a connect link and you can redirect your users there. You can use callback URL to let the users land up on your app. We also need to wait for this connection to happen. So let's do that here. So now we are done with setting up the authentication. Let's build the agent. So we are using OpenAI. So let's initiate that chat. We have already initialized the SDK. And now we'll do this. I think I'm going to choose a very simple task, like send an email to my email ID and say hello from the demo gods. So 
so we are done defining the prompt here but for the model to actually take action we need to pass tools first let's fetch the tools from composio so with composio you can either fetch a whole toolkit like gmail and pass it to the model or you can be very specific and pass whatever tools that is needed in our case we already know we want to send an email so i'm just going to fetch that tool great so now we are going to pass it to the model once you've given the tools to the model you also need to fetch the result and actually execute the tool composio also gives you a very easy way to handle this tool call in the users context so let's see how to do that we need to pass the user id here so the tool call actually uh, happens in the users context we need to pass the response I think we are done now. Like let's print out the result. Great, that's it. So we now have an AI agent that can send an email. So now let's run it. Okay, so we have the link here. Let's navigate to that. Great. So here you'll be asked permissions for your Gmail. And it redirected me to compose your platform. So now the connected account is created. Next, it's going to call the OpenAI agent and send an email. I think it's done. Uh, let's go check my email. Great. So I have an email. So it's as simple as that. We have over 300 plus toolkits on Composio. Take a look at our docs and cookbooks and build a production ready AI agent very quickly with Composio tools.